if anybody's over here. I can't have that many more kids. Aha! Uh -huh. Yep. Alrighty. Not from here. Mines are. They go around the barn. Okay. Nobody else in here. So. Who else am I missing? Got Larry. I got Eileen. I win again, Billy. You can't never, never, never beat me. Billy is a loser. Billy is a loser. Your name's Wanna play again? Derek, right? Uh huh. You bet. All right, that's Don't Marcus. Here, I'm still missing Dennis. Where did the last hat be? Moldy lemonade. Yeah, it's not great. I don't know why, but something about their singing makes me mean. Achievement unlocked, Limbo. Oh, Billy, are you still playing? I can party. I will come back to that. <laughs> you not know. I have time for it now. I didn't realize this was a thing. Creepy kids. Voices. So haunting. Shut up! I can't take it anymore! The crowbar. Alright. But anyhow, so... That just reminds me of the really creepy scene in Clock Tower for the PS1. That's technically a sequel to the first game. Uh, there's a really creepy part in a clock tower that haunted me for years before I even remembered what the game was called. I wish I was kidding. But I saw it online on some random site. And it was just this really creepy, like, thing about ghost kids and reading around Rosie. And then, like, I don't know why, but it just really stuck in my brain. And I was creeped out forever. Today's sermon. I doubt the circus will be coming to this town anytime soon. Yeah. But yeah, no, this whole game is just... There are some files here. Like, nostalgic creepiness, and I love it. Comment. An article about a new star in the sky. Many people saw this star, but an astronomer claims that the star is actually a comet. Hmm. Article about the annual town pumpkin fair. It's supposed to be the biggest yet. Let me know when it starts. Hmm. Ah. Interesting news. It seems that a comet altered its path and headed for Earth. The eye of God lights up the night sky. Interesting. Well, nothing else in here is clickable, so I'm gonna go ahead and pop out. That's a really cool thing about these old games, though. You never know what you're gonna find when you walk around. Like, it might look like a solid thing, like with those trees, but oh, look, you can go inside. Damn it, Dennis! Where are you? Maybe I can go. Nope. Okay. Schoolhouse. School. Hmm. Ooh. Okay. Blanked out of existence there for a second, but it's fine. Rusty old swing set. All right, let's see. That's not gonna happen. Damn it! Maybe I can get in the schoolhouse this way. Don't go there. I'll win it too. Move too. Dennis got in here somehow. I swear to God. Okay, that was a little bit violent. 
I'm also going to save. Save game. And with this, you can also type in your own titles, like, what the fuck just happened? Which I have thought about with this, so. Okay. And I meant to type half, but I typed saf, because that's how I roll, I guess. Return to game. Alright. My god. So many corpses. It's horrible. There you are. My god. What kind of hiding place is this? Yeah, this is pretty... Yeah. Bye, kid. That's a lot of corpses. Decayed bodies? Are these the parents? If I asked the kids directly, it might upset them. Yeah. Decayed bodies? Are these the parents? If I asked the kids directly, it might upset them. None of the papers seem to be clickable. Okay. Well, that's messed up. I think I got everybody. Maybe. I might be missing one. Found ya. Huh. That wasn't so tough. I found everyone in one fair and square. Now give me the key to the store. You big goat! You forgot about our secret weapon! I should have known you would cheat. What kind of crap are you trying to pull? Hey, don't get upset, mister. I told you the rules, I told you about the secret weapon, and you didn't win. What, what are you talking about? Weapon? I found all of you. <laughs> you didn't find all of us. What? You didn't find Carol. She's our secret weapon. <laughs> She's the best there is at this game. She's been hiding a long time. She did the king body? I win again, Billy. You can't never, never, never beat me. Billy is the loser. Billy is the loser. C. Driscoll. C. Driscoll. Sounds a lot like Carrie. Or Carol. A decaying corp. I wonder if she's the worm girl. That might also be, uh... Me Mare something? You know what I'm talking about. The one where she they were like, she was bad! I'm like, okay. Get us pumpkins. Too far away. How do I get on there, then? I need a stepping stone. What can I use as a stepping stone? I'm gonna break Mr. Pig, aren't I? Ouch! Good job. Can I use this as a stepping stone? No. Yep, actually I can. Look at that. <laughs> Holy shit, look at that. This girl's eyes are missing. Was she in some sort of accident? Uh, excuse me, little girl, but could I talk to you for a second? Sure, mister. I don't get many visitors. May I ask your name? My name is Maria. Maria, Maria Santiago. Uh, where? Where are we? What's the name of this town? There is no town. Not anymore. Okay. What do you mean, not anymore? Yeah. There was a town before Mother got here. People were happy. Everything was fine. Before your mother came to town? What do you mean? You're new here. You just don't understand. Great! No, I don't understand. You're only confusing me more. Could you explain it to me? Start at the beginning? I'm sorry. If you want to really understand what's going on, I think that there's lots of newspapers and stuff in the town hall. But I haven't seen one. Oh. Come back in a little while and we'll talk some more. I'd show you the way to the town hall with my eyes. Oh. 
I've read the old newspapers in the town hall, Maria. Oh, good. You found it. What do you want to talk about now? I haven't seen any adults in this town. Where are they? Where are your parents? I'm sorry, but Mother has forbidden us to talk about them. I understand. I keep hearing about Mother, but it doesn't sound like she's anyone's real mother. Who is this person? She's resting right now. Otherwise, I wouldn't speak to you. You're right, though. She isn't anyone's real mother. She's really... What is it, Maria? I think she's waking up. I can't talk anymore. Mother will hear me and get awful mad. But... Oh, damn it! A comet. Is that what happened here? Did the comet somehow make the plants around here grow so wild? Mother told us that the comet was a sign of her coming. A sign that we were special children. Okay, forbidden? Forbidden? But why? Why can't you talk about your parents? Please don't be mad. I'd tell you if I could. It's just that, well, I'll be punished again if I do. Oh, sweetheart. Punished? How? The pumpkin patch. She'll have me put in the pumpkin patch again. It's a terrible place. It doesn't look so bad from here. Once you're inside, everything turns bad. Oh. You've been in there before? Yes. The others dragged me in there. The other children? I did as they were told. The mother wanted to teach me a lesson. Oh, honey. What lesson, Maria? Yeah. Not to look for our parents. Mother said we should never ever do that. But I was too curious. Mother saw me. She told the other kids that I was bad. Then she made them put me in the patch. I don't remember much. Just those nasty birds. Black wings. They pecked at my eyes. It hurt a lot. But when the birds were done, Mother took the pain away. But that, that, that's... Horrendous! How could she do such a thing to a child? It's okay. It's not so bad now. I'm kind of used to it. Anyway, once Mother wakes up, everything will be better. Oh, honey. Okay? What are you... Please. I don't want to talk about it anymore. I've already said too much. Oh, sweetheart. The gate has a combination lock. Okay. Can I walk over here? Yes, actually. A big, overgrown pumpkin patch. Hmm. I can't walk up this hill. Damn. need to find that Carol person, which it looks like she died, so I'm not sure where I would find the person, but... Another headstone, Chad F, awaiting zombification. <laughs> I like that kid. Anyhow, poor dude or whatever, awaiting zombification. Okay. Hmm. I wonder if I just keep looking around if I find her. 